day. We are just learning now that a green energy company that received about $250 million in government grants, uh, grants rather, has defaulted on several of its loans and could be headed for bankruptcy. It's based out of Massachusetts. It's called the A123, one of the nation's leading manufacturers of electric car batteries. Now, this development comes after Governor Romney at the last debate raised serious questions about the amount of money, taxpayer dollars, spent on these kinds of green investments. Look, I'm all in favor of green energy. Ninety billion. That, that, would, have, uh, that would have hired two million teachers. Ninety billion dollars. And, and these businesses, many of them have gone out of business. I think about half of them, uh, of the ones that have been invested in, have gone out of business. A number of them happen to be owned by, by, by people who are contributors to your campaigns. So, Stu Varney, anchor of Varney Company, Fox Business Network, good morning to you. What's the deal with this company out of Massachusetts? It is another green energy bust. A123 makes electric car batteries. They were supposed to repay some of their debt today. They can't come up with the money. Furthermore, they say they might not have enough cash just to stay in business, so they are going to explore going into bankruptcy. Now, this follows the bankruptcy of N01, that's another electric car battery maker, bankrupt some time ago. Uh, the, the sole reason here, Bill, is quite frankly that uh, we're not buying electric powered cars. Even with $4 gas, sales of the Volt, for example, have been extremely disappointing. We're not buying the cars. We're not using those batteries. Down go the battery companies. Right. Another green energy bust. Are you, are you putting this company in the cylinder category? Uh, it's very close, yes, because they were given, A123 was given $249 million in grants. That's not loan guarantees. That's a check, a taxpayer check. They've only used about half of it, according to my sources. Only half of it, but that is lost money. If they go bankrupt, that money okay. is lost. So, yeah, you can put that in the cylindrical. Maybe this comes up again later tonight. Stuart, thank you. Sure. See you at 920, eight short minutes away.